um, we created our own kind of ceremony for our Broadway debuters. We had our we had a Broadway baptism. We baptized all of them into the into the family of Broadway, and then they had to run around and baptize the theater with good luck and 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 good energy. How do we make this very heightened text, which is the Bible, to be? as accessible to as many people as possible. And I think they did a, a wonderful job in 1971 of doing that, and now we are doing our 2011 version of that. Whatever it takes, if we get them to laugh, if we get them to cry, if it's a pop reference, if it's a, a musical reference, whatever it is, we're gonna get them to understand and feel this show. That's been really amazing, to watch an audience go, right, they were laughing a second ago, and now they're crying with us. And I think that's the power of the show, and that's, that's why the show lives on 40 years later, because it's so beautifully crafted in that way.